what's this engine? Um, is I heard this one's really affordable. Yeah. Jerome, this is a lot like your ZZ4 that we sent you. This is my starter, my entry-level crate engine. It's a classic 350 Chevy, iron heads. Now, we've got some options on this thing, but this is the important point for the folks watching this. This crate engine costs under $2,000. Brand new components, not remanufactured, not a rebuild, all brand new from GM. Mm -hmm. So you start with that, under two grand, and then you start picking options. So you can pick your chrome air filter, pick your favorite valve cover. We talked about the accessory drive on the big block. This is the small block front engine accessory drive kit. Okay. And then you can start filling this engine out like you want it to appear. Remember, we sent you a lot of the bling bling, Jerome, exactly. and you, you like that. You right? sent me a lot of bling bling. I like it chromed out. I like to just get that, like to look at myself, check my hair in the, in the mirror, all that. Hair looks good today. Thanks. Hair looking good. Thanks. All right, so that's the starter small block, okay? Let's go look at some big blocks. Okay. Now, how many horses in this, in this small block, just oh, so we know? Good question. This is a 290 horse. Okay. So very mild, very good street manners, runs, runs on pump gas. What's our torque? Torque, 290 pound-feet of torque. Okay. So good torque engine. A lot of guys with trucks put right. these in it as well. Good. That's a good That's a good neck massage right there. Hit the gas, you're going to get a little bit of that. Just a little bit. All right. Just a little. Don't Just hurt yourself. Yeah, don't hurt yourself. Well, let's go see the big torque monsters right, now. let's go. Okay. 572. Now, see, just the number has just doubled. We're just looking. Okay, talk about this one, Dr. Jamie. Walk me through it. All right, Jerome. So you wanted torque. Here it is. Again, still brand new components, still backed with a warranty with the street version. Right. This is our ZZ572. Now, we have this in a race fuel application that does not have a warranty because that makes 720 horsepower. But the street version that you can put in a street Impala, put in your Chevelle, 620 horse, 620 pound-feet of torque. You know, this is what we have in our 70 Chevelle convertible, and those things weigh like 5,000 pounds, and that car will scare you with a ZZ572. Now, see, this isn't for amateurs now. Now, we didn't, now Dr. Jamie has skipped us, okay? He took us down there with the 350 now we're down here at the 572 okay this is this is for the big boys all right we you know to take baby steps baby steps all right yeah i mean this is something that people would aspire to you know if if it's your first build if you haven't been around fast cars and, and you know how guys are jerome we all think we know how to drive we think big and we all know how we we all think we know how to play poker and we all think we know how to play basketball right 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 so this is a serious engine but again, it comes in a crate, all brand new. You buy it from your GM dealer, and it's it's ready to go. Now, how much does an engine like this go for? Okay, now this is a more expensive engine. This is again another one of our Halo pro products. Yeah, it is. This will this will be around thirteen thousand dollars. But again, to make seven hundred and twenty horse in the race one or six hundred and twenty in the pump gas engine, that's that's a really affordable price. That's not that's not that bad, you know. Especially you know it's. I guess because of the anniversary over there, did the anniversary to bumped it up the level, you know. So you could really just skip anniversary and just go for the jugular. Yeah, the 427 is nice, but if you just got to be the baddest boy on the block, you get a ZZ 572. And you know how most guys are; they got to. Be I know. That's why I brought you over here. Now, yeah. do you want to see the future at GM Performance Parts? Oh, take us into the future. It's all about the next generation. So let's let's go ahead and check it out. Let's go over here. Okay, take me to the future. What are we looking at with this particular engine right here? Okay, well, this is the LS3. Now, this is what comes in the two, 2008 Corvette. So this is the current small block Chevy that comes from Chevrolet. This one is actually an upgraded version. This one has a hot cam in it. So the base LS3 engine makes 430 horsepower. Right. This one makes 480 horsepower with just a camshaft change. So the future at GM Performance Parts is the fuel-injected LS engines. So this, you can see there's no carburetor, although we do have carbureted versions of the LS engine for guys that want to tune a carburetor. Right. But new at SEMA this year from GM Performance Parts, we're selling the computer, the harness, and all the sensors to make these very high-tech engines run in any vehicle. So your classic 64 Impala that you like to drive around in, right. you can now have the modern Corvette technology right in an old classic Chevy body. All GM components run it, GM computer, GM sensor, wiring harness, wow. very simple to go in. So 
An LS3 is going to be around eight, nine thousand dollars. Okay. That computer system's a thousand dollars, and you plug it in, and you have a 480 horse Corvette motor in your classic cruiser. That's the future at GM Performance Parts. You got the computer, you got the engine, and you're riding in 2008. That's right. And you know that the new Corvette will get 30 miles to the gallon. You got to remember, very efficient, very high horsepower. And, uh, you know, this is where GM is headed as a company. I want to make sure that your viewers are aware of the latest technology and they at least consider it before they buy a crate engine. Well, I think that's going to be up to the viewer. It's up to you to choose. You can go old school. You can go new school. But the bottom line is this. GM Performance Parts has you covered. Automotive Street Style is bringing it to you first because we know the importance of all you guys in the garage right now thinking about what you're going to do What's going to be your project car? Now you're going to have the proper information. I'd like to thank Dr. Jamie Meyer for taking us through some of these engines. And we're going to bring you some other stuff. We're going to you know, let you ch check on some other engines that he didn't actually go over. But just so you guys know, we took you from A to Z and then back to the future.